Oh, hey, Andy here. You don't need anything like this to take a screenshot. Let me show you how. So if I want to take a quick snapshot of whatever's on my screen, whether it's a smiling faces in a Teams meeting or like the data in the spreadsheet, I can use the quick keyboard combination of Windows, Shift, and S. That's going to open up the screenshot ability to be able to use rectangular mode, freeform, the window selection, or even capturing the full screen. So I want to use a rectangular mode to capture just this table here. Selecting and dragging that through allows me to capture it and I see that I have my snipping tool that pops up. Selecting that will allow me to make markups on whatever I just captured. So let's make that full screen and I see that I have a ballpoint pen, a highlighter, erasing any marks I make, even a ruler and I could even crop this image. Well, what's great is I can even change the color or the size of what I want to be able to write. So let's give some feedback and say, you know, hey, Andy, you know, great job on this. And I looked down at, hey, you know, Steve, what's going on? So I have the ability to now copy this and send it on to my team. If I want to save this, that's going to save it and actually create a file, which it's already done by taking the snapshot within your pictures and screenshots folder. So there you go, you now have the ability to take a quick snapshot using the Windows, Shift, and S combination.